So today's video, I'm doing an after school routine showing you guys what I get up to after school. Highly, highly requested, and this video is no, kind of. I really want to see this video. Thanks, Dan. And this I video. Dude. So this video is kindly sponsored by Pearson. And I thought I'd do a workout. I'm on FaceTime to Behind the scenes action. So me and Blue is in here, but I surprised Georgia with a present. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. So, Hi guys. I've actually got no top on top. <laughs> oh, shit. Just me and Dan. So, today's video, I'm doing an after school routine showing you guys what I get up to after school. This video has been highly, highly requested, and this video is no, kind of. I really want to see this video. Thanks, Dan. And this I video. Dude! This video. <laughs> For the wrong petrol pump. Oh yeah, someone was on the speakerphone. Like. Yeah, she's saying, number eight, can you come over, please, or something like that. But she's. She paid for someone else's petrol and she went, I wonder about it was so cheap. This Ooh. video is kindly sponsored it's by... Sunday, it's yeah. If your camera falls out the window, like, you've got to be careful. So this video is kindly sponsored by Pearson. So thank you for sponsoring this video. And we'll vlog when we get home because I just came out of school. It's 3.30. Okay, so anyways, I will vlog when I get home. Everyone, so we've just came home. Boys have got drinks and they're ordering Oh, there. sugar, have you the basket? What did you order, Dad? I oh, ordered uh, butterfly chicken. Aww. Because that's laying still. Okay, I need to wait quick, so. Do you want me to film? Mm. Okay. What do you have to say? <laughs> Should we go on a little tour of the house? Look, this is my this is my dad's ceiling. It's proper laying. This is George eating his. <laughs> what is George going to be ordering today? Did you get two sides? Two what? Sides. Yeah. Right. Oh. What is George going to be ordering? Stay away. <laughs> Share a path. We just got our food and I just... I don't want to swap you if you get plain dish. Yeah, because that's just pain. <laughs> Anyways, I got butterfly chicken and Oi, chips. What are you doing? Dan, what did you get? Yeah, butterfly chicken. And... And... Chips. Parasoli. And... Some ketchup. George? Mm. Okay, anyways. Oh, hi! I've got cheese and garlic bread. A little bit of. And now there's blah blah. Okay, anyways, when I'm done with this, I'll show you what I do next. Oh. Dan and George have just left because mum and dad have told me that I need to start revising because I have to do mocks next week and the week after but I thought I'd quickly go downstairs unpack my bag show you guys what I've got as like my timetable and then show you guys what I'm using to revise with like I said earlier this video is kindly sponsored by Pearson so I'm going to be showing you guys my new revision books everyone knows I don't like school but this is a really really helpful and easy way of revising without making it too too boring but we'll get into that in a second let's go get my revision timetable so I put my school bag in the bottom of my drawer but I need to find so in here I made a revision timetable oh, I just ripped it oops so guys I have got some blue tack and my exam timetable is here so I'm just gonna stick this on my wall but this is my exam timetable I tried to make it as fun and colourful as it is because it's really not fun and colourful doing exams on here we have the exam timetable it's a Monday so literally in three days I have my maths at two o'clock and then Wednesday I have my English literature at two o'clock and then also combined science then Monday I have English language Monday same day I have geography that, e that evening that afternoon Tuesday I have chem combined science chemistry and then Tuesday I also have business studies in the afternoon Wednesday I have maths and then Thursday I have physics and then Friday I have maths and that's my last paper. And then I've just wrote down like all the key points I need to revise. But I'm going to stick this on my wall because I think for me I need to keep myself organised and I'm really bad at that. So I'm going to just stick it on my wall here. 
And hopefully, that will just kind of remind me that I do need to revise. So, as I said earlier, this video is kindly sponsored by Pearson. I'm going to tell you a little bit about Pearson before I show you guys what I'm doing to revise. So, here I have a Pearson revise book, which you can get for mathematics in GCSE or also A level. You can get it in the higher or foundation tier paper. But I'm doing foundation tier, but I also got one for higher too for my friends as they're in higher. And I thought help a friend out, get them a revision book. So here is the revision book. As you guys can see, it just has tons of questions from past papers and it gives you all different topics like algebra. And then if you carry on, you've got things like probability and st statistics. I never know how to say that. So it is an example specific for AQA or also Edexcel. It also includes worked examples with your answers. So therefore you know what you've done wrong and you can go over it. Also comes with free online editions and video explanations to help you revise so I've actually been given Pearson books in the past by my teachers and used them but I've now got a brand new one to go through but this is really really good for making your confidence higher for when you're going into exams you can also learn tips from the experts that have wrote these books and also get tons of examples and it's really easy to kind of remember things as someone who actually struggles with dyslexia I think Pearson's a really really good way of revising in my opinion because you don't get bored there's so many questions to do and with what I have it's actually really hard to concentrate and stay revising and I know how hard it can be for others I know how hard it is to actually put things down on pen and paper and actually revise more than just sitting there and zoning out like I always do but with Pearson I'm really really finding it easy to revise this is a workbook which makes topic revision really really easy this really does boost your knowledge and actually help out with when you're doing your mathematics or whatever subject you're doing but for me it's math so I do need a lot of help so I've also got an English language practice paper so you actually get three full sets of practice papers to prepare for the exam through familiarization with the approach of the papers and the exam style questions so this is a really good way of getting yourself practicing for your English language or whatever practice paper you may be getting this for as in whatever subject so this is perfect for your responses with targeted hints and guidance to support for every question so there's also like steps to step skill builders with this as well which is really really helpful so I'm gonna do a little bit of revision now on here and just show you guys me revising for maths as that's my first paper that I have so I'm very very nervous but I'm gonna try aim to do around 10 pages of this maths just to start off with and then gradually move on to more tomorrow or in a bit because I don't like doing too much at once because I have a really bad attention span so I'm gonna do a little bit of revision now and film it what I do with my phone is I'm gonna just set a stopwatch for however long and it just makes me not want to touch my phone and I'm also going to put it on charge because good way of charging your phone while you're doing revision guys so it's day three of revision and i've just revised again with my pearson book but i just wanted to say if you guys want to get your hands on this i'll leave a link down below you guys can go get it because i know it is a really really good helping hand with your gccs or just mocks in general and i definitely recommend for anyone in year nine coming up to year 10 or if you're year 12 going into year 13 or if you're year 10 going into year 11 any of them years it's very very beneficial for us so yeah make sure to go order your own pearson revision book now i'll leave a little thing down here okay. guys so i have done my revision i'm now just working out so i'm in my new workout set which is really really cute and i thought i'd do a workout so there is this trend on tiktok where you press up and then go into handstand i've never been able to do it so i'm going to try it now I think I just done it. That is so cool. I've literally wanted to do that for so long. I think I just done it. So, one sec, George. So, <laughs> I'm on FaceTime too. Behind the scenes action. Oh, I'm on FaceTime too. Say hi, George. Oh, what are you saying? What are you saying? I'm on FaceTime to George. And Bluey's with me. And basically, I want to show you guys my new tracksuit. Because I got this new tracksuit and I think it's really cute. So here's the top. And then 
I'm not wearing the bottoms, but these are the bottoms. Okay, so yeah, this is the tracksuit. And what am I doing? Love Island's on in how long? Mm. 10 minutes. 10 minutes. I'm so excited. There's a new girl and she's already pretty. Okay. Because they are hot. They are hot, apparently. So me and Blue is in here, but I surprised Georgia with a present because she got first in her uni degree. Congrats, Georgia. See, she used Pearson revision books and that's how she got a first. Oh, I use their revision cards, they're so good. Oh, Georgia used to use the Pearson revision cards, so you can also use them. But I bought Georgia stuff. Yes, yeah, so I'm surprising Georgia with dunks because she really wants these Jordan dunks, so I'm surprising her. And then I also got her chocolate clusters because I wanted them, so if I buy them for her, then I can have them. And then also a chocolate chip cookie. So yeah. How about, How about I, just I just take, take my time? time? Call of my life. Girls need love too. <laughs> so I got these popcorn. It's not, they're just all falling in here. I really don't like the Coke Pops anymore. You don't like what? Why? No, it's not my vibe anymore. This has all got to I be binge. Because the plastic bag. It's because they have 30% less sugar now. Yeah, I can taste it. Come on, I'll have a word with Kellogg's and sort it out for you. Kellogg's! Kellogg's! Listen to us. So Love Island's on, but before we go back, round two of Love Island. That's all we have in here. So guys, we don't really see Hugo anymore because my nan's been living with us. It's always with her. Hugo, we see so Coco Pops and Love Island. Let's chill by the fire. Hey guys, so Love Island's just finished and it's time to do my skincare routine. I may run myself a bath because I really need to shave my legs, but I just I hate like a full on bath, but I'm gonna do it. I've got really sensitive eyes as well, but I don't know why, like my eyes are really red and that one's not, so that's a bit concerning. I always get problems with this island, like I've just always have an itchy eye or something. I'm gonna run myself a bath, but whilst we wait, I'm gonna do my skincare routine now. It's not changed whatsoever from like, God, I don't even know when I last done my skincare routine on a YouTube video, but. Yeah, skin's not changed. I mean, skincare's not changed whatsoever. Yep, nothing to really talk about, but I'm just putting on my CeraVe Framing Cleanser. I'll show you guys what I'm using in just a second. When I put on my cleanser, I love to proper get it like everywhere. Like that, and then I use this, which is the Danny Levi Makeup Puff. I love it so much, it's my favourite. And I miss Danny so much, I haven't seen her in a while. I just go through and wipe this whole thing off my face, like so. So at the moment, I haven't really been putting on makeup to school just because it's been so hot recently that like literally putting on makeup seems like a chore in this weather because it means I'm gonna have to put Kyla on. But, oh, here we are. So, I just cleansed my skin and I used my always cleanser from CeraVe. And now I'm gonna go in, I'm gonna quickly put on some cold water from the tap and I'm just gonna clean out my retainer. Cause yeah, I do have a retainer. I don't know if anyone even remembers now, but I did have braces for like a year. No, I don't have them anymore. I'm now going in with the Ordinary Niacinamide plus, I think it's 2% zinc. Best, honestly, best thing ever. If you've got any spa, uh, scars from spots or acne scarring, I 100% recommend. So I'm just gonna brush my teeth quickly. So I've just got the bath. I just shaved my legs and my armpits and I'm watching Bates Squad's new video. Well, not new, it's old, but I've already watched half of it and I want to watch it all again because I love being scored too much. Let's go in my room. Clean my room because it's a bit messy and then I'm probably going to go to bed. But I'll update you guys when I'm in pyjamas. <laughs> I 
and guys before i forget make sure to go get your hands on your pearson books now honestly these have been lifesavers for me throughout this whole revision thing but yeah make sure to go get your hands on any of the pearson products here they are again if you want to get the same one as me but i'll leave a link down below for you guys to go get whatever you need for whatever subject you may be revising for and just a reminder you can get practice papers and you can also get revision workbooks and also cue cards so it's completely up to you what you want so yeah make sure to go get your hands on all of them now okay guys so i'm now just moisturizing my face as it's basically the end of the video so i'm going in with my glow shot and there we go i think this is a good time to end this video i just like to say thank you all so much for watching i'll definitely be doing one last after school routine maybe even on the last day of term if you guys would want to see that but thank you so much for watching this video make sure to like comment and subscribe and i hope you have the best end of term or if you're already on your end of term i hope you have a really good summer and yeah thank you for watching make sure to go follow me on instagram tiktok and make sure you're subscribed and also make sure to go add me on snapchat it's amelie charlies and yeah see you guys next video. Bye!